welcome back to my fall 2021 clean with me i'm just showing you guys some of the stuff that i'll be working with i'm going to be starting off with my coffee bar this sign i actually had from last year which was from hobby lobby a lot of the stuff i actually already had the only thing new there would be the jars that i'm going to show you that i got from walmart those mugs i ordered from macy's because i needed some new cups and then also the spoons in there i ordered from h m and that's basically it that cup i had over there that's decorated in the pumpkins that's from cvs as well and i'm just showing you guys what i'm working with and we're going to go ahead and get this area cleaned off It's a sour taste in it. It's a sour taste to be fooled again, honey. To be fooled again. Stole my heart and ripped it into pieces. Yes, you did. You know it's not the way I planned. No, it's not the way I wanted. No, it's not the things I meant. Know that I'm not being honest. Not the way I wanted us to make it. It's 
that we know will fail Stop my thoughts for no given reason None at all No, it's not the way I plan No, it's not the way I want it No, it's not the Of course, I have to give you guys a before shot of how everything is looking Jay cooks spaghetti, so I'm just gonna pack up that and then wash out the dishes. I wanted to do a summer pot. So what I'll do is tomorrow, because I'm not going to get to the family room tonight, I'm going to do that tomorrow. Um, pop probably. So I'll make the summer pot with you guys and also a nice drink. I'm just basically going to wipe down the counters, put the food up, wash out the pots, and just get in here tidied up for the night. And then also I wasn't really doing too much purchasing of um, decor right now but we went to walmart the other day and we did see these cups they were like 189 jay picked up three different ones that he liked so we picked these up i'll figure out how i'm going to display these probably on a little tray or something somewhere for some drinks and then i'm going to try to use this somewhere in the kitchen and of course this right here i'm probably going to put over the stove just to give it a little something for uh halloween for the kids
I've got this feeling I'm feeling you could be the one I see no reason Why I should ever let you go mm -hmm. I don't wanna wake up If I'm dreaming Because you know I can't get enough Of this feeling you're giving me Don't wanna wake up
guys know I like to show you the after. This is how everything looks, nice and clean. I put up those dishes. I'm going to style this corner really quick. You see I took the other stuff I had there up. It's gonna be something simple that I'm gonna play around with. Like I said, it's just for the kids, for them to have some Halloween decor. But for the most part, everything else is clean up in the kitchen. Okay, so this little plate thing here, which I showed you guys, well, I didn't show it before, but I told you guys about it in my other video. I got from H&M, and it's marble. And I believe this was like $24 or something like that. So of course guys I had to give you another overview with the little decor in the corner here and also the new piece that I added over the stove. Like I said it was just a little added touch for the kids for Halloween you know adding a little something there for them and they love it every night that pumpkin in the corner there goes on and that's just something that I had and I actually DIY'd and you know added a little black spray paint to it and I'm just giving you guys a little look of everything of how it looks when the lights are out. And those bats I had up for a while now, so you're going to see the bats over there by the TV. And I also have some up by the desk, which you'll see in the other part of the video when I show you tomorrow. Good morning, guys. It is another day. Um, it's actually like a day or so later. Mason actually had been under the weather. It's just been a lot going on, appointments and all that type of stuff. So it's early. It's about 9 o'clock in the morning. Got some night together really quick before I start cleaning, which I have to get the family room together. What you see back there, I'm going to make a um, another simmer pot. This time I'm going to be using one orange, two lemons, some allspice, cinnamon stick, and bay leaves. So I'll show you guys that really quick. Also, stay to the end because I'm going to be sharing a simple recipe with you guys, a little drink that you guys can get into as well. So let me get the simmer pot started so I can really get, get into this um, cleanup of the family room really quick. And this is what... My baby's still kind of sick. This is what the family room is looking like. He just kind of in, in and out of his sleep. You see Mason's toys. This is how he usually has it. I was able to get those stuff cleaned up last night a little bit. I'm just going to be tidying up over here. I am going to be changing out my um, tray, the styling of that a little bit, and just, you know, straighten up the cushions. I have to sweep and I have to mop and also tidy up Zoe's um, desk and just getting the stuff out of this area tied up as well.
it's not on you, my baby I'm just not the right kind of girl for you You deserve somebody who's loving you You shouldn't call me later Promise it's for the better I'm just not the right kind of girl for you Cause I got a rule I hold on to my heart Share with nobody I don't want nobody Serious, can't you just be mine for a night, my love? Take it off, put it on, then be on your way. It's not your fault, my baby. It's not on you, my baby. I'm just not the right kind of girl for you. You deserve somebody who's loving you. You shouldn't call me later. Promise it's for the better. I'm just not the right kind of girl for you. Cause I got a rule. I hold on to my heart. Okay guys, so I got in my stuff from Joanne's. I told you guys that in another video. I actually got in my coasters as well. So what I'm gonna do is I actually want to restyle my tray on my ottoman. So I'm gonna give you guys a little um, styling a on that, how I restyled that. Some ideas to show you um, some things that you guys can do for fall. But just in general, when you're trying to update your space, um, you can just use things around your house, moving things around, which that's what I did on my um, TV console as well. And my nook over there, I just moved some things around and I'll show you guys all that stuff in a minute. No 
tray is looking. Tell me guys how you like it. And I definitely will be changing it up again. I'll have everything linked below that I can link. The fan is on, so it's actually not going on. But there we go. Got it. smells amazing see I changed up over here this area here change it up a little bit what do you think here and then over here of course it's looking of course the tray And there's always a little area I took and I added this little pumpkin here. Oh, let's see it from this way. Hey guys, it's the evening time now. Everybody's watching TV chilling. And I'm making me and Zoe a pumpkin spice latte. And I'm gonna share it with you guys. Basically, you're gonna top it with some whipped cream. I'm making double the recipe and I will have it linked below. Um, Zoe's over there dancing. I will have it linked below in the description box if it's something that you guys want to try out. But let me show you real quick what you have to use. So basically, you need whipped cream, organic pumpkin puree, pumpkin pie, which is pumpkin spice that I have. And then this is the sugar. I'm using brown sugar. And then I double the recipe, of course. I'm using a cup of milk. I have both of our cups here. And then I have my pot here going. Simmer pot is still on. House smells amazing. And we're going to start making it. 